I was doing 24 Days of Zoella, a lot of you requested I do a video showing you all the new things that Lush have to offer this Christmas. Being the huge uh, fan of Lush that I am, is that how you say it? Did I just say that right? Or was that grammatically very incorrect? So actually, although these products have been out for a while, I know that a lot of you might want to get your friends or your family some of these for Christmas because I think bath products make amazing gifts. But also, I know that a lot of you also share my love for Lush, which is why Lush actually very kindly sent me one of everything, oh my God, one of everything that they have for Christmas. Oh, because they are just the most generous people in the world. I would say I've probably been buying Lush Christmas products for six or seven years and every Christmas I get more and more excited about what new products they might have on offer. I'm also gonna be demoing some of my favorite ones to share with you as well. Because there are a lot of products, I'm not gonna go into too much detail. I'm literally, this is going to be a lot of showing and not a lot of telling. We'll start with shower gels. Twilight says settle down with a dusky blend of sweet tonka, heady ylang ylang and soothing benzoin resinoid. 40 winks is only a multi shower away. Oh, it smells lovely. Oh, it's quite like lavendery. It does smell like it would really send you off to sleep. Next up we have Ponch. I think that's how you pronounce it, I'm not sure. Tequila, add some zest to the fiesta with fresh orange juice. Okay, so this is very citrusy. Ooh, I really like that. And generally I'm not a fan of orange scents, but that is really good. Next up, we have the classic Snow Fairy, which isn't actually my fave. It is a lot of people's fave. It's very, very sweet. I think for any of you who prefer to shower with a very sweet scent, you will love this. I actually do have some of this in my guest shower because although it's not my favorite, I know a lot of people who do like it a lot. Rose Jam. This says Turkish Rose Absolute and conditioning argan oils dance their dizzyingly floral fragrance over skin, leaving a gentle lingering perfume behind. So this smells of roses. So if you like that kind of rose, kind of fresh Turkish delight kind of smell, you'll really like this. Bubbly. Now I don't know if I've, heard of this one before. A Bucks Fizz breakfast boost packed full of sweet orange oil and fresh grape juice to help your morning go off with a bang or should that be a pop? Oh, this will be a nice one to use on Christmas morning. Oh, I like that. So this is like a different kind of orange to this one. This one smells more like, it reminds me of something and I don't know what it reminds me of, but I really, really like that. Moving on to bath bombs. This is the Never mind the ballistics bath bomb. Ooh. Oh, it feels really like, it doesn't feel very powdery on this side. It says, create a sunset in your bath, fragrance with sweet orange and lime oils, watch as the yellow and red layers intertwine to create a dusky orange color. The red side of color is coated in a layer of fair trade cocoa butter to give your skin an extra treat. <gasps> That's why it doesn't feel like a bath bomb. Oh, it smells nice, it's really fresh. I think that's gonna be a winner. Next up, we have mistletoe. Say it with love this festive season and give the gift of kisses. Watch as it fizzes away pink and green that mix to create essential deep purple. This bath bomb is romantically fragranced with floral jasmine, exotic lang lang and earthly vetiver. Ooh, okay, I love the scent of this one. It's quite like soft, it's not too overpowering. Love that. Next we have the Father Christmas bath bomb, which they bring back every year. Everyone loves him. There he is, his little cheeky face. Oh, okay, so he smells a little bit like Snow Fairy, but a much lighter version, so it's quite sweet. And he makes the bath go red. Next up is the Luxury Lush Pud. Again, this one is quite a classic. I love this one because as you can imagine, this makes the color of your bath look incredible because all these little bits fizz away individually and it looks like crazy. So this has lavender, tonka, creamy benzoin resinoid. I'm probably saying that wrong. Benzoin, benzoin, benzoin resinoid. Stardust bath bomb. This is one of my favorites, but I love the smell of it and I love how it makes the water. It goes kind of like milky. Oh, and it just smells amazing. So this has 
vanilla and rosewood, as well as bergamot, add a citrus kick and a boost for the mind and body. And this also has some tiny little, like, I think it's got little stars in it. I can't really remember, but I love the smell of this one. Next up, we have Shoot for the Stars. Oh, the colour of this one. You just know this is gonna make your bath look insane. This one says, launch into the bath and watch as a midnight blue blanket unfolds to reveal the sweet fragrance of Brazilian orange and bergamot oils. The shimmering stars all the way through this ballistics are made with cocoa butter and olive oil to give your skin extra nourishment. I love the ones that um, moisturize your skin as well because you always end up getting out of the bath just feeling like you don't need to moisturize. Next up we have everyone's fave golden wonder this is the big old golden shaped present which makes your bath like this amazing like turquoise blue it's so good and it smells incredible sweet and citrus watch it in wonder as it unwraps itself to reveal its glittery contents if you don't like glitter you won't like this one it's a sparkling turquoise explosion with citrus blend of uplifting sweet orange and refreshing lime and coconut oils so white which is actually one of my favorites i feel like i've said that for all of them but this genuinely is i actually reach for this every time oh look they've made it look like a little apple this year so this smells like the freshest apple you've ever eaten watch as blues and yellows fizz out to create a crisp apple green i feel like last year it made my water red i might be wrong but i believe I believe it did. So they've changed this up a little bit, which I'm excited to try. Then we have Butter Bear. I love Butter Bear. As I was saying, I love ones that do things to the skin and this one really does. So it has cocoa butter to make you feel as snug as a bug and leave your skin feeling soft. And it just smells like vanilla and ylang ylang. Mm, I have no patience when it comes to opening these. Northern Lights. Oh. Do you like this one? No, it looks great. That's Joe, by the way. <laughs> this... I've seen that one. It's qu is quite a spectacle in your bath. It spins, doesn't it? Yeah, it sort of does that. Yeah. And the colours all come out. Yeah. Yeah, it's really impressive. The ballistic is making a comeback and it's better than ever. Northern Lights will create the effect of a beautiful night sky by fizzing out blue and yellow as well as popping candy, which works its magic by creating the effects of stars. It's scented with floral jasmine and ylang ylang. I feel like Joe might be stealing this one off me. Bubble bars. This one is new. This one is called Ruby Red Slippers. I'm very excited about this one. Click your heels, say there's no place like home and take a trip home for Christmas. The slippers will take you all the way to a ruby red glittering bath full of floral carnations and spicy clove oil. Put your phone on mute. Oh, it's a glittery one. So if you don't like glitter, actually it's not too glittery. It's not too bad, it's a tiny bit, but not like excessively, which I quite like. It's in the shape of a little shoe. Oh, that smells amazing. Oh my God, that really like is quite strong. So obviously with a bubble bar, you crumble this under the running water and it creates mountains of bubbles. I am a mountain. I, I am, am a tree. Oh. oh, now this one is a personal fave. This is called Snowy, which is inspired by the legend that is David Bowie. How cool is that? I think Ziggy Stardust. Yeah, isn't it so cute? So Aww. this bubble bar is decorated with a sparkly flash and multicolored eyes. Crumble under a running tap to fragrance your bath with refreshing grapefruit, uplifting neroli and floral rose. <gasps> oh my God, that reminds me of something. And I don't know what. Smell this. It's like something we had as kids. I don't know what it is. Ooh, yeah, what is that? This is up there, one of my faves. This one is also new this year. This is the Jester Bubble Bar. This looks so cool. I love this. How cute is this little guy? He has a little bell. So this is a reusable one. So you swirl this in your bath or you can just hold him under the running tap. Revitalizes your skin with a super citrus blend of tangerine, Sicilian mandarin and bergamot oils. Gardenia extract is also added for floral, for a floral flash. You're putting me off because you're snapchatting me. <laughs> oh, I'm behind the scenes of a Zoella video. This one is the most citrus item so far. It smells like lemon sherbet. I like it. <gasps> Lemon sherbet. Lemon sherbet. Lemon sherbet. Lemon sherbet. Lemon sherbet. There's so many new ones, I'm so excited. Is the crazy San little dance? Santasaurus bubble bath. 
Oh my god, is this not the coolest thing you've ever seen? I feel like this was made for Tom Fletcher. It's Christmas and it's dinosaurs. Although, the shell of it looks quite like a duck, I have to say. <laughs> Ooh, I like the smell of this. So it says, inspired by a nativity gone wrong, the dinosaur is just roaring to get in the bath. Crumble will hold in a running water to create an ivy green colour in the water and produce a scent of com- and produce a scent of comforting honey, refreshing orange, and fruity bergamot. Bergamot? Bergamot. This is a winner. I like this a lot. This is also a favourite of mine. This is the magic of Christmas reusable blah blah blah. This is Christmas in a bath product. Everything about this smells and looks like Christmas. You've got a bit of glitter, you've got the, the star anise, some cloves, cinnamon, Oh my God, it smells incredible. This one is also a lush Christmas classic and it is the Magic Wand Reusable Bubble Bar. This smells like Snow Fairy. So if you love Snow Fairy as a shower gel, this is your bubbles equivalent. Then we also have your classic Candy Cane Mountain, which again, smells like Snow Fairy, but this is a lot more like intense, I think. Doesn't really say what it has in it, it just says, and a comforting, creamy candy mist. Oh, smells good. Peeping Santa Bubble Bar. The reason this is one of my favorites is because it smells like a bubble bar that came out in a Valentine's collection back in like 2010, maybe. Oh, it just smells so good. It's kind of like strawberry-ish. The Christmas Penguin, how cute. He reminds me of the Wallace and Gromit Penguin. Ooh, okay, one of my fave smells. This is orange flower absolute, Sicilian mandarin and lemon oils to revive and refresh your mind and body. That smells incredible. We also have the Snow Angel Bath Melt, which if you are having dry skin issues, you literally drop this in your bath, you get out and it's like you've got new skin. Really? <gasps> yeah, I love these. Have you never used a lush bath melt? No. <gasps> They're amazing. It's kind of like um, almondy, Mmm, I love it. Marzipan scent with cocoa butter, rose, benzoin, and cassie absolute. Mmm. We're not too far off, guys. Snow Castle soap. <gasps> okay, so this is kind of like that marzipan -y scent that was like snow cake. So give your skin a treat with this luxuriously creamy soap. Coconut oil base to create more lather and added almond milk for extra silkiness. It's very almondy actually. This is a lot more almondy. I really like this. This is the Shooting Stars soap. Ooh, look at that. That would last you ages. Ooh, zingy lime, lemon, and bergamot. This is really citrusy. Hello. Do you want to come and sit in here as well? May as well. Smells good in here. Doesn't it? Next up, we have. Igloo. Wow, look at that. I'm not sure about the scent of this one. I don't think this is quite my scent. So this is rose and Sicilian lemon oils. So it has an alluring floral scent. Mm, not sure, but it looks beautiful. Next up, we have Santa's post box soap. I've got everyone in here watching me right now. I've got Nala scratching her legs. I've got Joe scratching his arsehole. And I've got Alfie just standing behind the camera with his legs like apart, just like, Power stance. <laughs> it's a power oh, stance. That? It's very intimidating, Alfie. <laughs> That's better. He's crouching now. Santa's post box. Okay, Ooh, wow. That matches your eyes. What? If you close Which your bit? eyes. <laughs> the red? If you close your eyes. There we go. Does it? Yeah. Oh, I like the smell of this one. This smells, again, this smells like something from my childhood. So this is a refreshing citrus fragrance that will send your skin to heaven with the smell... I'm gonna go get some sushi. Have fun. Could you get me a baguette? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Bye. This will cleanse your skin and leave it smelling of sweet orange flower, mandarin, and bergamot oils. I love the smell of that. Reindeer Rock Soap. Now, I haven't seen this one before, but it's so cute. Look! It's like someone's painted a pebble. Oh, that smells good. New and improved soap, a royal blue pebble full of romantic roses and anti-inflammatory um, lingonberries to give you a comforting fragrance as you cleanse. I think this is the biggest Lush haul I have ever done. <laughs> Next up, we have Baked Alaska Soap. 
How cool is that? Oh, that's good. This soap will give you a zest for life as it reveals its true colours. Bright, bright fluorescent orbs that come into view as you wash with uplifting lemon and tangy grapefruit. Yum. Okay, so we've got Fireside. Oh my god, how cool is that? That's so cool. Oh, do you know, it actually has like a, quite a fiery smell, like woody almost. I like that. Magic wand soap. I like the shape of this one. Oh my god, that's like, do you know what this reminds me of? You know those sweets that you can get at the cinema that's like the long like tubes filled with the cream? It's like a giant one of those that's been cut in half. Oh! Oh my god, that smells incredible. It smells like black currant. Fun. Fun is, it's kind of like bath play-doh. So you can mold it into anything you want and then you can put it in the bath and it creates bubbles. So you can get a Santa one, which gives you all the colours for creating your very own little Santa. We've also got Elf on the Shelf. I love that. So you've got Elf colours. Cute. They've also included some feet. What? That's cool. Basically, if you get bored in the bath, which I can imagine some people might, you can sit and mould shapes. Like, it's like being a big kid, which I think is why it's called fun. Reindeer and Robin. Perfect. And, oh, last one. A snow fairy. And this one has wings included. And of course, they all have different scents. I did not know this. So I always used fun as bubbles, like a bubble, like a bubble bar. But you can also use it as shampoo and body wash. I did not know that. It's like a three-in-one product. That would make a very nice gift for someone. Shower roulades. These make me very excited. Where are they? Yoglog roulade. These look so cool. So this is what it looks like. It looks like you've actually cut a roulade in half. I could eat that. A luxurious solid shower smoothie made with a blend of almond milk, fair trade cocoa butter and coconut oil that all work together to give, your skin, give you skin that feels like silk. Fragrance of spicy clove and sensual ylang ylang to sugar coat your skin. Incredible and I'm so interested to use one of these in the shower because I've never used one of their shower roulades. Then we have candy cane roulade which looks like a cut in half candy cane. Oh my god, oh it's so like, it's like melting in my hand already. Oh my god, this smells amazing. Minty Heaven, made with added soy milk for extra softness and fragrance with peppermint oil as well as Cocoa Absolute to add a chocolatey twist. That's why this smells so incredible. We have this, which I used last year and loved. This is the Salt and Peppermint Bark Scrub. It's in the most amazing scent. It's like spearmint. It's like a really, like, kind of, it's the kind of mint that makes your mouth water. Oh, I just love it, it's amazing. This is the Snow Fairy Body Conditioner. So it says, um, this glittering pot of conditioner is scented with mouth-watering bubble gum and the classic comforting fragrance of vanilla. Wave a wonderful over wet skin and rinse for silky soft skin that's sweet as sugar. So you can wash as normal and then condition your skin in the shower. How cool is that? and it smells like the classic Snow Fairy. I think a lot of people are gonna really like this and it has the iridescent blue glitter in it as well. <gasps> okay, that looks really freaking cool. Um, and also we have this one, which was also out last year, I believe, and this is the Chris Dingle Body Conditioner. I really liked this. So I have one of these in my shower still from last year. It's like this amazing blue color. <sighs> and again, it's a really lovely, like not too strong mint. And I love that. It's a lot more refreshing, I think. Shower jelly. Everyone loves a good shower jelly. Um, we've got Santa's belly, which looks like Santa's belly. I'm not going to get it out because it's very, very messy. But when you get it out, it actually has a shape. Um, and that one smells of ap fresh apple juice, red wine, and refreshing apple fragrance. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, speaking of Santa, he's here! We also have the snowman one, citrus duo of Sicilian lemon and bergamot. It's oh, a nice one, very refreshing. And then there's a new one called Papa Noel, which is in a slightly bigger container. And it's, it's French for Father Christmas. It is, well done Joe. And it's a beard. What the hell is that? <laughs> What is, is that supposed to be a beard? It's a beard. I'm not putting it on my face. There you go. Oh, don't! What's it made out of? Look, it's a shower jelly. 
So you wash with it in the shower. How amazing is that? Can you imagine if I bought one of these for Alfie and I just walk in the shower and he's going, ho, ho, ho. I just think whoever the genius was that came up with this, you deserve a pay rise. I'm never gonna be able to fit this back in the pot now. Okay, lip scrubs. We have some new ones. So we've got Sugar Plum Fairy. So these are sugary lip scrubs. So if you have dry lips, you can put this on. This what does that smell like to you? Oh. Blackcurrant. Um, Blackcurrant, like Ribena. It's some sweets I used to have back in the day. Yeah, it's like a certain like smell. No, refresh, um, fruit pastel ice lolly. Okay, so Joe says this is fruit pastel ice lolly. Then we also have the Santa Baby, which uh, was out last year as well. Oh, smells good. This one is a cola flavoured lip scrub. Amazing. Ah, okay, and then we've got the lip tint. So we've got a Sugar Plum Fairy lip tint, which is this kind of berry colour. Very pretty. And then we also have the Santa Baby lip tint, which is in a red. We're nearly there, guys. We're so nearly there. Okay. We have a new body lotion called Sleepy. This excites me because this is something that you can put on before bed and it will make you feel all relaxed and ready. So it says, jump straight into your gym jams after smoothing this calming lotion all over from top to toe. Made with lavender water and a lavender infusion to soak your mind and body. Organic fair trade cocoa butter is added as well as Illipi butter to moisturize while almond and jojoba oil soften. Oh, oh my god, I love the smell of that so much. I think this is gonna be one of my winter staples. A new dusting powder. So this is designed to help you get a great night's sleep. This shimmering dusting powder will soothe your skin and mind. Made with lavender to help you relax, chamomile powder is also added as it enhances sleep. Sprinkle all over your bed sheets. Roll around and you will be snug as a bug. I love the sound of this. I've never used any of their dusting powders before. Oh my God. That's like proper lavender. That's like walking past lavender flowers. I love that. That's amazing. Imagine putting this on and then dusting this afterwards. I feel like it would be a great combination. Then we have fairy dust dusting powder, which I'm assuming smells like snow fairy you could have like a full-on snow fairy experience from like start to finish couldn't you the last thing that i have to show you is this which is bouche bouche de noel i'm probably not saying that right which is a fresh cleanser a deliciously fruity boozy concoction packed with ground almonds cranberries and a drop of brandy for an elfy glow though it's a little bit more like messy they're really cool you should try them so this says that it brings radiance back to wintry skin by using a blend of softening almonds, cleansing kaolin, nourishing festive fruit, as well as a dash of brandy. Fair trade cocoa butter ensures your skin always stays soft. That is everything that is available to buy in Lush over the festive season. I'm sure there's something there that you wanna try or that you wanna buy for a friend. I can't wait to use these in my bath. So thank you very much Lush for sending those to me. It's very generous of you and uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did and I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye.